असलम सेवन्थ क्लास वेलकम इन द सेकेंड सेमेस्टर आई एम होपफुल यू आर आल फाइन आई एम योर इंग्लिश टीचर एंड हेयर इज़ द वर्किंग ऑफ डे फिफ्टीन एंड सिक्सटीन सो लेट स्टार्ट द वर्किंग द स्टोरी ऑफ कैश कैश हु लिव अलॉन्ग ऑन द रिम ऑफ पॉलर सीज वॉज है ऑफ इस विच विलेज मीन्स काउ थ्रू मैनी एंड प्रॉस्पेरियस ईयर्स प्रॉस्पेरियस मीन्स हु शाल एंड डाइट फुल ऑफ ऑनर्स विद हिज नेम ऑन द लिप्स ऑफ मैन सो लॉन्ग अगो डिड ही लिव हेर ओनली द ओल्ड मैन रिमेंबर रिमेंबर मीन्स याद रखना हिज नेम हिज नेम एंड ही टेल टेल मीन्स कहानी विच दे गॉड फ्रॉम द ओल्ड मैन बिफोर दैम एंड विच द ओल्ड मैन टू कम विल टेल दियर चिल्ड्रन एंड देयर चिल्ड्रन children down to the end of time moving to the book work choose the best answer and the air is filled with flying white this refers to the cloud in the sky snow in the wind in the birds the answer is snow in the wind cash decided to go hunting in order to answer is feed himself and his mother and ensure all got meat the means by which cash killed animals was by answer is head craft cash sent a reply to the consul to say his igloo was large and comfortable in order to answer is make them come to him and thereby show his power the next is match the following idioms with the meanings given below it's all boils down to answer is in short to iron but differences to smooth over an argument or quarrel to leave it well done not be interfere uh, with something to mind one's ps and qs uh, the answer is to be very polite and careful about what one says or does to spell the hears to make distinction that are too small to be important or of values in short and last is to rain cats and dogs to rain heavily here are words meanings warm garam remember yaad rakhna prosperous khushal ya asuda deviant taqseem karna silence khamoshi spear neza success kamyabi mystery raz business karobar hastily besabri ya jaldi se ya tezi se tremble kaapna ya larasna pause panje tribe kabila ya grow and disappear gayab hona The first question: How was the story of cash remembered from one generation to next? The story of cash remembered from one generation to next through storytelling. What does the author mean by he had seen thirteen sons? Why only thirteen? The author means that the boy is thirteen years old. His people's view of measuring years is in sons because they are so far not. It is dark for half the year and light for the other half. so the sun rises and sets only a year who was bok and how did he die bok was cash father he was killed by a polar bear while trying to kill it in order to feed his people during a time of famine what complaint did cash make at the the consul cash complaint at the consul was that he was not getting a fair share of the meat the portion and he and his mother received was often tough and old how did the men react to cash's statements in consul meeting the men reacted to cash's statement in the consul meeting by shouting at him to go to bed because he was only a child they felt that he should not have been complaining the next is what did cash been doing to make him sleep for 20 hours cash needed to sleep for 20 hours because he had been out hunting for the first time he had traveled out uh, along the shoreline and killed a she bear and two half grown cubs what did cash resolve to do why cash resolved to go out hunting by himself and to share his kill fairly he wanted to ensure that all were provided for no widow nor weak one shall cry in the night who was sent to follow cash and why beam and bond were sent to follow follow to cash to find out if he was using which trough when hunting the bears because the consul could not understand how he was successful at it in what way did a glock text cash a glock text uh, cash with the accusation to his face that he was using witchcraft what was cash headcraft 
catch Hercraft was clever thinking and inventive idea that allowed him to hunt successfully. The next is what impression do you get of of life of people in this polar region? Is it a hard life? In which ways it is hard? We get the impression that life was hard because of the reference to a time of uh, famine. It also seems hard because the people depend on hunting to get food. Hunting is physically demanding and dangerous. And the last one is describe cash hunting method. What other methods of hunting are there and how they are different to cash method? Cash method involves wakening uh, the animal from the inside. Other methods of hunting are on horseback with bow and arrows hunting with the dogs trapping striking and the animal from afar or using another animal to attack and wear and it cares mostly ex exercised headcraft and not witchcraft so dear students that's all about my today's working thank you assalamu alaikum